What's up, fellas? Today we got a special unboxing. Apparently we've made it big or something because I've got demo units directly from Twi Twinkly in this box. From Twinkly's warehouse. It's on there somewhere. Anyway, back it up. Let's see what's in here. I don't know what's in this Hold box. Yeah. yeah, there it is. All right. It's gonna be exciting. I am allegedly, according to what I was told was in this box, the first person to get a demo unit in the country, maybe in the world, of the new four port controllers and strings. Ooh, there it is. This controller is for sale. The strings are not. And I'm really interested to see how these strings are different. But first, this apparently is one quantity of 250s. Okay, so well, the count doesn't match what I was told would be in here, but that's quite all right. Wait a minute, this is another one. So this is a, this is, what is this? Okay, was there another box? Just the two. same size. I don't even know what's in this box. I got Oh, this is the replacement for a bad string. Let's let that to the side. Okay. So first I want to open up the controller so we can take a look at it. I've no, never seen one of these. Uh, directions are on the back. This new controller is called a Twinkly Plus. It is either a Wi-Fi or Ethernet, which means it's it sits between the pro and the home edition currently however it also takes separate strings and i don't know what they're going to look like this is smarter than the old one though you don't have to configure the strings when you hook up to it it knows what they are and allegedly it works with man look at that thing isn't that a pretty piece of equipment Power supply goes there. Must be in this box. That's a massive piece of stuff. Let's see. You read the specifications on there? I can't. I got my glasses on. Hold uh, on, let me put them on. I cannot. That's all right. Hold on for that while I get these glasses on. Anyway, that's much smaller than the Pro Controller I currently have. Here's the external ethernet plug, which you don't have to use. Four ports, let's see what this plug looks like. Oh, four prongs. I know why it's that way too. There's a resistor in the plugs and that's how it identifies the light strings. Oh, my goodness. All right, this is the new strings. Let's see here. They look like they might be a little smaller than the current Pro ones. Have to get out a millimeter and measure that. Yeah, maybe the same. If they're the same, that's cool. Let's see. Is there a button on this? Ooh, there he is. That's what we're going to do. Test it out. You got it. Is there anything left in this box? Just more strings. There's three more sets of them in there. Can I move the box? Yeah. So I can but see that's not where I was going to set this anyway. God dang it. It's always the third way around when it's twisty ties. Just like USB cables. <clears throat> Jeez. All right, that goes to the power supply. See how hard it is to do something simple. Standard plug too. That it's the same connector type that the uh, the home edition strings take. It's just a much larger power supply. All right. I don't actually know for sure I'm gonna be able to get this to turn on by hitting the button, but 
usually with a twinkly device, you just have to uh, push the button on top and it cycles effects. We'll see, won't we? Okay, there's the four plug. Turn it the right way. Turn it the right way. Will it do anything? Oh, there Oop. it goes. There it goes. Yeah, now we're talking. You guys should have also noticed that those plugs were screw on and gasketed. This is a complete waterproof device. It can be used outside, including the power supply. The plug on the new controller is four pin instead of three. That means as of right now, there the wires are not backwards compatible with the existing pro controllers. And it has a notch in it, so it's keyed. I've also been informed that is currently all they're going to be offering is RGBW for this device. So you're dealing with a thousand lights at four channels each. And it's capable of approximately 21 frames per second running a thousand of them. That's more than twice as fast as the current Pro devices have. What's the button do? Oh, the standard twinkly effects. Is anyone surprised? I'm not. All right, that's good. Compared to the other ones though, those lights look a little bit bigger. They are, they are bigger than the Home Edition, but they're not bigger than the Pro, the Pro lights are. All right. Well, there you have it. That's a good uh, initial setup. I like, I think I'm gonna be using these pretty soon outside. This is an extra thousand lights to my show. <laughs> I'll see y'all later. <laughs>
I'm hoping to see some more exclusive unboxings. Uh, but for now, uh, enjoy seeing the first review available for the Twinkly Plus device, four port Wi-Fi and Ethernet controller. John and Jessica out.